Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. And in this video, we are talking everything Auburn Bay, the pros and cons in living in one of Calgary's most popular lake communities. So stick around. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. This is Living in YYC. I'm Mark Newstater. I'm Natalie Newstater. And we are with EXP Realty here in Calgary. You're talking to a uh, lifetime Calgary resident right here. Mm -hmm. Natalie, you've been here a long time. Yep. Back when you were young, Auburn Bay would have been like a, a, farmer's, field. a farmer's field. <laughs> <laughs> Calgary's expanded just a hair in the last, uh, last few years. Uh, but in any case, so in today's video, we're talking everything Auburn Bay, the pros, the cons, and then stick around for a bonus tip at the end. So we're we gonna start with pros or cons first. Cons. All right, let's do cons first. I think the first con, you know, if you compare a lake community, and this probably goes for any lake community compared mm -hmm. to a non-lake community, it's gonna be a little bit more expensive. So when we look at pricing as of the end of March, 2024, the detox price was 8026, which is a 10% increase year over year. The semi-detached price, 528,400, which is almost 11% up year over year. And Natalie, why don't you take the row and apartments? So rows are at 462.5 and it's up almost 18%, 17.8% year over year. And apartments are at 372.9. So they're up 18 and a half percent as well. Right, so, you know, I guess the, the pro to the con <laughs> is you're getting a lake community, which we'll talk a little bit about yes. in the next uh, few minutes here. I, I would say the only other con that I can think of, it's, it's always about access here and there. You are in the deep Southeast portion of Calgary. If you wanna be in a newer community, generally speaking, you're gonna be in the outskirts of Calgary. That yeah. is just the way it is, but you do have to understand that you know, you're you're going up Deerfoot or Stony Trail to get to the airport, which depending on traffic is, you know, 25 to 30 minutes away. But that would be the really the only con for me about Auburn Bay. How about you? Yeah, I would agree with that. I think it is a harder thing because just like we said in our mahogany video, if you are going uh, into the community in uh, rush hour traffic, it can be a bit of a nightmare getting up on 52nd Street off yep. of Stony or you can have to, you're going to have to go all the way around on Deerfoot to come in on Seton Boulevard and then getting into the community that way. So it really does depend on which end of the neighborhood you live on. All right, that's great. So let's hit our pros list now. And there are a few and it's got to start with the lake, right? The lake is fabulous. It's a bit smaller than Mahogany Lake, but it is coming in at 43 acres, which is pretty, pretty big. I yeah, it is. Bigger than Bonavista, I believe, yep, isn't it? I believe so. Um, lots of beach activities, things like that, but they also do the skating rink in the summer, or in the winter, pardon me. You don't want to skate in the summer, you don't want to fall in the water. Um, they have all sorts of, uh, they stock it with trout. There's four different types of trout yeah. in the lake and a carp, not the Prussian carp, but the other one. So it's it's pretty cool for kids to be able to go fishing after school or on the weekends yeah. with your family. I, I think it really has that family feel with that Lake Association. It's just a really warm feeling uh, beach community there in Auburn Bay. And we've had clients that are purchased right on the lake and they absolutely love it. Yes. And there is the one fish that you're supposed to catch and kill because it's the a Prussian invasive, carp. The it's Prussian invasive, carp. Yeah, it's yeah. an invasive, invasive species. Yes, exactly. So. Pro number one, the beach and the lake and all the uh, stuff that you get to do because you live in a lake community. Pro number two for both of us, we felt was the amenities in the area. So unfortunately, unfortunately, you're very close to the South Calgary Health Campus. You don't wanna have to go there, but if you do, it is literally across uh, Boulevard there and you'd head south and you're right there at the South Calgary Health Campus. But let's talk about fun things, <laughs> fun things. You actually went to Rendezvous, which is like a, uh, a nightclub slash restaurant, and it's got this super cool uh, dance floor. Dance floor, yeah, right? It's all lit up and it's glass and it's a lot of fun. And they had great bands in there. And that's just across the street in Seton there from um, Auburn Bay. The other nice thing right in that area, you've got Superstore, you've yep. got uh, the theater, Cineplex. They have the really cushy uh, the VIP. theater there. Yeah, it's really nice to go see a movie in. Um, you've got lots of shops that Auburn Bay Station is right there and they've got everything, co-op, 
they've got, you know, liquor stores and yep. dentists and Blackbird pub, shops, which, we Blackbird pub, yep. which is really good food too. So yeah, it's really close for everybody. And again, if you were working from home, you have a very walkable community that you can get everything you need in that community without having to go, you know, 15 or 20 minutes away. Yeah, and speaking of walkable communities, our third pro about Auburn Bay is schools. Because again, that affects your lifestyle. How much you have to drive, what, what time you have to get up in the yes. morning when it's minus 30 and it's a blizzard. Well, good <laughs> news, there is on the public side of things, there is a public K-5 to school right in Auburn Bay. The middle school is shared with Mahogany. Yeah. And then for high school, if you're on the public side, you just have to hop, skip and jump down into Seton for your high school. Now on the Catholic side of things, there is a elementary school right in Mahogany. There's a middle school. Then for high school, you will be going over to Legacy for high school, but that's a huge pro, right? When you don't have to drive and, yes. and bus your kids everywhere, that's massive. Yes, absolutely. And I do believe the elementary school in Auburn Bay is new, like it just yes. uh, two years ago. Yeah, it, it is Something very like brand new. Running, so, yeah. yeah. So place a comment down below. Do you live in Auburn Bay? Do you love it? Do you not love it? We'd love to hear your pros and cons of living in Auburn Bay. And thank you for sticking around for the whole video. And here is a bonus tip. If you want to live in a lake community right now in Calgary, you're gonna need some help. Um, yes. We are the people to help you. So call us, text us 825-256-5007. Why would you wanna do that? Well, we are South Calgary residents. Natalie's lived here her whole life. I've lived here since 1991 when I had Rick Astley here. I joke about that all the time. Um, it has to do with the Chinooks or something. Um, <laughs> but in any case, we want to be able to help you out. We start with a buyer consultation so we can understand what you're actually looking for, what your budget is. Let's get you pre-approved. And then once you're ready to go out looking, you have to be ready to move in a seller's market where there's limited inventory. If the market changes, obviously we can change up our approach, but we got to start with a game plan. And that's what we're going to help you do during that buyer consultation. So we're also going to put a link down in the description below so you can book right into our calendars and we look forward to seeing you soon. So thanks for watching this whole video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and don't forget, call or text 825-256-5007, and we'll see you next time. Bye.